up, guys? It's I, Jane Poop here, back with another bonus video for Resident Evil 5! And this time, we are going to do the other DLC-based mission, uh, this time Desperate Escape, which is longer, uh, slightly longer, and harder than Lost in Nightmares, though it's not really long, it's about the same length, but it is harder than Nightmares, so... So, yeah... So we're going to do single player again, uh, again, we're going to do amateur mode, and let's see what the game is like, shall we? What the game mode is like. Chill. Chill. Are you alright? Chris. I'm so sorry. It's okay. You're Sheva, right? Yes. I couldn't control my actions. Oh my god, I was still aware. Forgive me. It's all right. Thank you. Listen, I'm gonna be all right. You two need to stop it. We can't just leave you here. You have to. This is your only chance. If Wesker succeeds, Uroboros will be spread across the globe. Millions will die. Oh, yeah. I'm all right. You need to stop him. Chris, you're the only one who can. Before it's too late. Don't you trust your partner? Wait a minute. You are Jill Valentine. How? Who are you? Captain Josh Dole, BSAA West Africa Guard. I've got to say, I never thought that I would get the chance to meet you. Thanks. So what are you doing here? I'm looking for my comrade Shella and Chris. Have you seen him? Yeah. They both went after Wesker. He's on some tanker. I saw one anchor offshore. Do you know where they are headed? Yeah, but it's already left. It's too late to get to it now. It's never too late. I got a helicopter with him and I'm going after Sheva. You got room for one more? <laughs> There's always room for a beautiful lady. I bet you say that to all the girls. Just the pretty ones. Come on, let's go. Yep, so this takes place after Chris and Sheva fought Jill, so then then Captain Josh Stone uh, wakes her up basically and then we gotta go for a escape that is so desperate. And here we go. So yeah, Desperate Escape, pretty much vastly different, because um, obviously Jill's in a combat based outfit, she's kind of a bit like uh, Zero Suit Samus from Metroid a bit, but uh, because of the blonde hair and such, but I mean, and, and the fitness, but still, 
And then we have Captain Josh Stone, who is pretty much the same heavyweight as Chris Redfield, but only it's basically like the black version of him. Sort of. Um, okay, we've got a gun here. And then... Right, uh, I'm just gonna... Go this way. Now, we're going to take his handgun away, because you, uh, there is an achievement. There's quite a few difficult achievements in this. Oh, we've got a magnum. There's a couple of difficult achievements in this. Uh, and a couple of them evolve... Um, uh, one of them is killing 150 enemies, and that's by yourself. So it's recommended to just uh, have uh, no guns on Josh, or... It depends on who you play as, obviously. It's likely always Jill the first time you play, but I mean. And is there gonna be something in here? Just some hand grenades. Right. There we go. And the other achievement is the harder one to get in this. Uh and, and we're going to stay here for a while until you find out what I'm talking about. So, we need to kill this clan thing. So we need to kill this clan thing. So then we get... Uh, oh, he's not dead. Okay. Oh, no! Luckily, Josh has a uh, health system, uh, health for us. Alright, he's dead. We should have a key, yeah. But we're not going to leave yet. We're going to try and kill every single enemy here. Because in order to get this one to work. Alright. So... Oh god. He's just shot me in the face. There we go. And then. Then we gotta just uh, go this way. Oh god. Then I'm just gonna kick him. There. There we go. We got that. Then, boom! Oh wow, we went him on the other side. Uh, just, just shoot him there. There we go. And then, I don't know if it'll be enough enemies because it's hard to tell. But we should get a cutscene after a certain part. So yeah, there's a couple more enemies here. Hit him! There we go. Why not? I'll hit that. Why not? Oh, lovely. There we go. We've got a magnum as well, so we can use that later on. Uh, doesn't seem like there's any more enemies here, though, so... I think we might be safe. Uh, and if not, then I can always do it again. And just drop the other ones. So, the cutscene should play after we go up here. If it doesn't, then we've not got it. And I don't think we've got it. We've not got it. Okay, so. Um, uh, it's likely I'll have to do this again. Because Desperate Escape is very hard. So, uh, I'll have to do this uh one achievement later. Oh god. 
Well, actually, hold on. I'm, I, I'm actually, I'm gonna try and get this achievement. That's the cutscene you should get. All right, guys, my apologies there. So we need to quickly get to that guy that we just saw in the cutscene. It is the Magini with the micro with the microphone thing. So we need to get him down. I'm just gonna continue shooting him. There we go. We killed one. There are three of these enemies in order to get an achievement for. Yes. I'm not joking. The first one's probably the hardest one to get. Along with the last one, sort of, it, but it depends on your timing. The second one's actually very easy to get, though, so hopefully we'll do well with that one. Alright, so I'm going to get my rotten egg out, because I've, I've got a rotten egg somehow. I'm going to get Josh to get us up here. And then we're going to, um... Just wait here. I'm going to see if I can throw this at one of them. <laughs> there. Lovely. Lovely. And then, he's dead. Because obviously we can't keep the rotten eggs here, and obviously we can't eat them, so... Just use them as weapons or something. And then, I'm going to open this so Josh can go through. Alright. Alright, there we go. They're throwing cocktails at us. One, two, three, shoot! And then, one, two, three, shoot! And then, boom! Kicked him. I'm gonna stab him in the belly button and then stab his bottom or not. Shoot him in the face, kick his nuts and then stab him. Oh, you didn't really need to heal us there, but whatever. Alright. Oh, nice! Uh-oh, we got burned. But he's killed anyway. Right, and then we need both of us to uh, kick the door open, and then... chubby guy again. Oh, whoa. And this is how Josh runs into enemies. Oh, we got, um, we got, we got the, we got the person who plagiarizes Leatherface from Texas Chainsaw Massacre again. And, oh, we killed the fat dude. Oh my god. Alright. Oh, I missed that. Alright. How about this? It's the chainsaw guy. Oh, he's there. Alright, how about this then? Oh, I missed. And then... That. Oh, he hit him again, oh my god. Oh, and he got burned! Oh my god, oh, there's two of them. Alright, he's dead. Then... Oh no! close to us. Jesus Christ. Oh, there's something here. The emergency exit key. Okay, we need that. There are score stars here as well, but you don't need to shoot them all to get an achievement. It's not like Lost in Nightmares, luckily, so you don't have to worry about that. What you do have to worry about is the harder achievements you get in this. So, yeah. So the achievements in Desperate Escape are harder than the Lost in Nightmares ones, for some reason. And yes, you're dead, obviously. And you just get that from him. Alright, um, I don't have a grenade with me. So unless I can use my shotgun. There we go. One, two, three, shoot! And then... One, two, three, shoot! There we go. And you're dead. But before we leave, I'm just going to kill more of these, because obviously I want to try and get that achievement as well. It's that, um, the Agitator Magini uh, 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 achievement I want the most, which is 
uh, the ones with the uh, microphones. Um, oh, I've heard another chainsaw. Oh no. Oh, now we get grenades. Okay. Oh, we got a flash grenade, but I have no choice but to put it this way. Oh, wow, I launched him off. Okay. Two, three. Throw! I guess I'll burn him over there. There we go. Then I'm just going to get this. Or not. Where is the chainsaw guy? I don't know. Because I can hear it, but I can't see it. Alright, I'm just using a shotgun for a bit. Where's the chainsaw? Unless the chainsaw's in there, I don't know. Oh, and it, Oh, God! Oh, God! Yep, there was the chainsaw. Luckily, you don't have to worry about losing the uh, agitator achieve the Magini achievement, because they're always killed, so it doesn't matter if you miss killing them. And... Is that a chainsaw? Oh my god, it is. Let's just keep stabbing him. Is he gonna die? Okay, no, he's coming back to life. Right. I think stabbing him enough will deal enough uh, hits to hurt him, so... And then, hit him like that. Hit his bottom, there we go. One, two, three, kick! And then... One, two, three... Lovely! Got that done. And we got that. Then, I need you to get me up here, Josh. There we go. And then... Let's shoot that. Boom! He exploded. And then... Da, 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 da. Oh, another chainsaw appeared. Oh, no. Luckily, this chainsaw will be easier. Because I can just burn him now. Now! shoot him. I don't care if I get an S rank here as well, because obviously I can just do it again. Um, and the way you get an S rank is obviously uh, killing most enemies possible and not really missing with your gun too much, so don't just shoot for no fucking reason, just uh, shoot whatever you can. Now we've got this fat dude, and Got them defeated. Come on. Right. Pick, can pick that up. We've got that, and then, and then I'm gonna shoot you in the face, and then, boom. It doesn't matter if I get the score stars. I, I'm gonna see if I can get as many as I can see. So, yeah. But because obviously getting points is good. So, yeah. I think dying too much may not give you the S rank as well, so I'm probably not going to get the S rank because obviously I've died already, so. But still. Oh. Oh no. Oh god, he's difficult to aim. Oh. One, two, three, kick! Just do that knee drop. I've heard another chainsaw. It's from up there in there. Three. There we go. Whoa, that was close. Jesus Christ. Oh, there's the other chainsaw. Hello. All right. 
Hello, Chainsaw. Out of the way, Josh. Yeah, there we go. I'm just going to keep shooting him with the... There we go. There we go. Uh, why not? I'll just... Uh, there's a couple more enemies I'll kill here. Make them fall down here. I'll use this grenade this time. Why not? Or can they even get out from there? I don't think they can, so... Yeah, they're stuck. So we're just gonna have to... Whoa, they slid down, oh my god. Okay, reach him, there we go. Okay, there we go. Oh, there's an egg here, what? It's a rotten egg. Oh, nice. So I'm gonna use that. On you! On your face! Oh my god. Right. Uh, now we'll go in here real quick. To see what's in here. It's just another gun. It's a machine gun. Oh my god. I think that machine gun will be better then. Okay. Uh, I'll just have to finish using that one first. And then... I guess I'll... No, I don't want to give it. I'll get rid of this gun then. There's no way to sell items here. It's just um, all that, so. So I'll just use this machine gun for a bit. I think that's every enemy here, so. You just use the key here, and then get out of the door, and then wait for Josh. And then, boom, we can get through. Also, there's a score star all the way in the distance, so I don't know if it's, uh, well, it is possible to get. I, I did manage to get it before activating a cutscene, so I'm going to try that. It's a bit difficult, though. Come on. There. Lovely. And now, I'm just going to, I'm just going to use this machine gun for a bit. Josh, I'm sorry, but I have to go to the communication facility. There's something I have to tell Chris. Okay, but don't think you can be that easy. The trouble is weak because we are in the communication facility. So we are heading in the same direction. Thank you, Josh. Okay. And we just need to drop in. There we go. And now this is the hardest part of Desperate Escape. Because you can see we're taking lots of hits. And we got these guys. And thus, we need to open this gate here. You need a hell of a lot of firepower to take that down. True. There's a lot of things there. Go. So I'm just gonna make Josh do these things. Oh god. So in fact we'll need Josh for one part, so we need to uh, get him this way. If you're on higher difficulties, you'll also get those bug enemies that I hate so much here. Luckily, you don't on amateur mode. You will get these enemies in amateur mode, but not in this section, at least. So that's a good thing. Oh, God. Oh, wow, he died. Right, we need, we need Josh to come up here, because there's a door that we cannot open without him, so... Down. There we go. Then, I'll just make him attack for a bit, and then, and there's this guy. We just hit. There we go. Nice. Nice. I need him to grab that. I'm just gonna. I'm just going to shoot these, why not? Then I'm going to use this to shoot down this gate. Right here. And it's destroyed. And then... I'm trying to kill him, but it is a bit difficult for me. Might have gotten, I'm not sure. You can also destroy rocks this side, I think they're already destroyed, but... 
destroy those rocks. Let's destroy this, why not? Why not? We'll just destroy some places that we can't. Okay, there we go. Right, that's run out, so now we can just focus on using the other machine gun. I need ammo. Use this. Alright, there we go. I can just focus on using this machine gun now, which is better. Alright. And, uh. Now I need to go this side. Come on. So I need Josh to go this way. Come on. Understood. So I need. So now I can just go on to attack him. Nice! Destroyed a lot of enemies there. Oh, but this one is uh, hell of a pissed off. There we go. One, two, three, shoot! Oh, come on, I missed three shots, seriously. I'm just trying to get him, there we go. Boom! Jumped on him! Like you jump on your father's belly button. <laughs> okay, just get him. Alright. Alright, you gonna uh, uh, not don't You know we'll fall off. Alright, just die for once. Alright, here uh what we're we gonna get here. Oh rocket launcher Now I gotta use I'm just gonna use this. Oh. Now it is random what weapons you get as well. It's very rare to get the rocket launcher. I'm glad I've got that. I'm going to save that to the end. Okay, so... There's an oil canister there. Oh, hey, Josh. Okay. <laughs> He's still getting burned. Okay, there we go. Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill these. Oh, this is a chubby dude. I'm gonna get my machine gun out. There we go, he's down. And there's a nerd we can get. You'll likely want that, Josh. There we go. Right, I don't know if we need this one, because obviously... Unless we do, I don't, I don't know. I forgot. We can get that up for optional use, but there's nothing else we can get from here. Right, there's nothing else we can do here. So, so we just got to go the proper way. So I'm gonna get it. Then boom. Right, this door is where we need to go. Gonna burn these all so then all of them burn. Burn, 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 baby burn. Do a roundhouse. Lovely. Ah, oh, it's still on fire, come on. Oh, hello, fat dude. Alright. I've got the oil thing on you. Boom, you're dead. And now, we've gotta go up this one. To then kill the guy up there and assassinate him. One, two, three. Ooh, you're dead. And then I'm gonna shoot this one over here. There we go. And I'm just gonna try and kill him. I don't know. There. Yeah, just heal yourself, whatever. Um, drop kick in. It's not really a drop kick, it's a double kick or something, I don't know. There we go. Now we need to go up this one. Oh, he's seriously not dead, come on. Alright, so let's uh, kill you. 
Alright. Got you there. Oh no! Got hit by a bomb. Oh, he died. Okay, at least he's easy to get to now. And we just need to shoot that door now to get through. Luckily, this is easier on amateur mode, but on other difficulties, this is very hard. Like, it took me, like, about probably 10 attempts or something. Oh, there's a magnum in there as well. You know what? I'll... Oh, you know, I'll tell you what. Let's, um... I'll use up this gun. I don't care if I don't get the right accuracy because I'm going to do this again. Oh! So I'm just going to get rid of this. Along with this. And I'm going to get this Magnum. Because I need... Because I want to be like Dirty Harry. So... Then... I'm going to destroy this! Boom! Lovely. And then, come on, let's jump on these. Or not, okay. Alright, there we go. Right, I, I say what. Oh, for fuck's sake, Jill, what are you doing? Get down. Uh, don't you go up as well, Josh, come on. Oh my god. It's like talking this to myself, but my, my real name is also Josh. Sort of. And, um, so, so basically, our partner is basically the black version of me. <laughs> I don't know. That's what I always thought. But, I don't know. <sighs> Anyways, go for here, we should get a checkpoint. Yes. And then... There we go. Nice. Hey, uh, do, 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 do. Hello there. Oh, this guy is here. I'm just going to keep shooting him. Alright. Now, I don't know if he can get burned, so... Alright, I've got him. Oh, there's the fat dude. I'm gonna get in. There we go. Now I'm gonna try. Oh, he got burned again. Oh my god. Just like the first one we fought in the actual main game. Nice, he's dead with just one shotgun blow. Nice. It gives you tons of points. There's also a lot of ammo here, but obviously some of them we don't need anymore. Okay, even though he doesn't have a shotgun, he can at least uh, hold it for me. I don't know if we'll get those beetle enemies, though. It might be random if we get them or not. Alright, so I'm gonna kill you guys. Nice. And then here is where the other where the other agitator Magini will appear. He'll appear this side. Luckily, he's the easiest one to get. Uh, because you just have to wait for a cutscene to play. Oh my god, the fat dude's here. Oh no. Where is he? Oh, he's there. I just need to get rid of him. There we go. Alright, so let's just, uh, Can't use those, but... Alright, whatever. I'm just gonna kill these. Then after killing these, we should get the other Agitator Magini, which is the one with the microphone. Or Silophone, whatever, whatever the fuck they call those things. So more of them should appear. Right, so I'm just going to discard this, why not? Right, another one appeared. Shoot him. And then we're gonna shoot him. Good boy! The, to the gun. Then, he's dead. We should get one appearing in a moment. Or maybe after these. 
got those killed. There we go. The other one's right there. I'm just going to use this. It's a bit difficult to tell when we get him, because obviously he's all the way far away. Yeah, we got it. You can tell we got that. So, there we go. There's that. I'm going to throw that. Alright, let's just get this rotten egg. Now we just need to get Josh up here. Because he was fighting all along. There. At least I've got the second one. I don't know if I'll get the third one. If not, then hopefully I will, because obviously uh, I don't want to fail him. Uh, I can I can just I can just reset through checkpoint uh, uh, in order to get him. So so hopefully I will get him. Damn it! The bridge is up. Doc, come in. The bridge is up. I'm going to need you to come to us. There's a landing pad on the roof of the communication facility. Can you meet us there? Anything for you, Miss Valentine. I'll be waiting for open arms. He's quite a character. Alright, was there another one? Yeah. I'm just gonna throw that in, why not? Alright. Alright, I don't know if I'll need this, so I'll just uh, throw it in the air. Why not? And then we'll just open this. And then we watch this cutscene. Which you'll partially recognize. Give me a hand. Okay. I set it to broadcast on the same frequency as Chris's PDA. Uh, please be there, Chris. Chill. Are you alright? I'm fine. Don't worry about me. Just listen carefully, there's something I need to tell you. Wesker's superhuman strength, it comes from a virus. But the virus is unstable. In order to maintain a balance, he must inject himself regularly with a serum. So if he cuts the supply of serum, he loses his strength? Affirmative. But he just took a dose, so it's gonna be a while before he needs another one. Damn. Listen, Excella said that the amount administered has to be precise. So if he injects too much, it should act like a poison. I think she used the serum label PG-678W. PG-678W? I'm gonna try to find a way to escape. You need to find that serum. Excella always kept it with her, in an attaché case. Sure. Chris. Chris? It's no good. It's being jammed. It's okay. I told him what he needed to know. Pretty. Doug should be on the roof by now. All right. And then we welcome to the hardest part of Desperate Escape. Doesn't look hard so far, but trust me, it will get hard. So this is where my Magnum will come in for some of the harder enemies. And you can use a exploit to make it easier, but obviously it's not really relevant for amateur mode. So, yeah. I'm gonna see if there's anything else we can pick up before. Um... You take it. Okay. Come on. Understood. Okay. Okay. And I'm just gonna give that to Josh. I owe you one. I'm just gonna request that. Use this. I'm gonna request this as well. Use this. Oh wait, I can't use that. Okay. All right, I'll discard this then, and then I'll... Use this. And then that, okay, there we go. We don't really need rifle ammo, so you can keep that if you want. <laughs> so, all right. Now, let's go on with the hardest part of Desperate Escape. Here we go. Because the chopper is not here. Here, we have a timer, so that's how long we do this, so... Right, I'm just going to use my guns to kill them all now. Or what I can. 
So yeah. And occasionally, out of the elevator, we'll get the hard, some of the harder enemies. And the very last one will be a Agitator Magini, but it varies on how how good you are at this part, so hopefully we'll get him. If not, we can just we can just restart my checkpoint, so. Because that works. The other enemies are random, so I don't know what enemies we'll get. We got this guy, okay. This is where we need some magnum. Oh no, I got burned. Oh my god. It's a bit difficult because he's there. Alright. I'm just going to use my magnum on him. There we go, he's dead. Uh, I think the other one will likely be a uh, one of those, so... And there's no way of getting magnum ammo, so we'll just... Uh, we'll just get that shot on There. Even though he can't use it, but okay. <sighs> okay. He can just pretend to be Dirty Harry, I don't know. And then... There we go, we got in there. I'm not going to shoot those gases until uh, we get more of these. Oh, god damn it. I'm going to shoot him and that at the same time, so then... Oh, wow, he got shocked at one as well. Nice. Right, there we go. But also, up here, there is actually a, uh, a star that you can shoot. And this is the spot you would normally use to cheat. But obviously, we don't really need to do that, so... Because we're on amateur mode. But if you're on a higher difficulties, I do recommend doing that. Especially on professional, if you're trying to just get the achievement. Or trophy, depending on what you're on, but still. Three. Ooh, shot you in the leg. Not bad. Ooh, ooh, stop them. Then we're going to stop those, and then... Uh, Josh is pretending to be Dirty Harry, so, uh, oh god, no, and then, BOOM, and then, one, two, three, SHOOT, and then, look at that, and then, and I'll shoot him, but the timer will eventually reset, so, meaning it's longer than you think. But it's not that long. Oh, hello, Chainsaw. Um, I'm just gonna dodge him. Alright, nice. There we go. Let me just get these. We don't have to get these, but obviously, if we want better score, then we would, so... Yeah. Oh, wow! He went flying. I think there's one up there or something, that's why we're getting the shoot in. There we go. There we go. Nice. Boom! Then. I'm gonna grab this one. There we go. I'm just going to use my machine gun, why not? And the only other time where the F word is used in this game, it's only used twice. Once in the main game, once in this. So only twice. Okay. Shoot you. There we go, you're dead. Oh, get off me. I'm just gonna use my shotgun now. Then, when we get to the Agitator Magini, I'll use my rocket launcher. But first, we should get those chubby guys, which I'll use this barrel for. Hopefully we'll get this done on first try. Because if so, then that's a relief. 
We might not get the S rank achievement though, obviously, but I don't mind. Alright, here he is. Right, he's gonna hurt me. Oh, we got an achievement! Way of the Warrior, that's uh, 150 enemies. So we can give any guns to Josh now. Right, so I just need to dodge. Oh no! We died! <laughs> At least we got one achievement. This is going to take a while. I don't care how long this video takes because obviously this could be longer than normal. We'll give that to you. Right, so it don't really matter. Oh god! Oh, we got the gas being destroyed as well. It doesn't matter about how many enemies we destroy now. That's why I recommend giving the guns to yourself and keep them away from the partner. So then, he's so because the because the kills have to be from you, it cannot be from the partner in order for it to count. So that's why. So then, I don't know if we'll get another enemy now, or if because it's normally those either those Gatling gun guys or or those guys with the massive axe. So, it's either one of those. Oh, he's there. Gonna shoot him. Come here. And yes, if you're near him, he will hurt you. And then, just gonna kick him. Oh, he's down! So I just recommend doing that. I'm just gonna keep using my machine gun. There we go. And then, oh shit! Hello there. Hello there. Oh, thanks for healing me. Yeah, the hardest part is when both characters die because it's it's likely that your partner will die more than you most of the time. So that's the other hard part. Ho hopefully, we'll get it. I want to try and not shoot that. I'm just gonna shoot this, why not? One, two, three, shoot! Oh, headshot! Nice! Oh, come on. Alright, so I've got the Magnum, but obviously I don't want to use that. I want that gun. Oh god damn it! I'm trying to request the gun and it's not letting me. Jesus. Because I don't want to use my magnum. Alright, I'm just gonna have to use a grenade for a bit. Oh wait. Okay, there we go. So I got a lot of ammo for that. There we go. There we go. There we go. And then... Oh, crap. Oh, thank God he's going away. I'm just gonna... Come like that. Then... Nice. Oh, lovely. And he exploded. Uh, there we go. Right, and then you can use that to heal us. There we go. And then we need to wait for another... We need to wait for the... Oh, the for fuck's sake text. And then... Um, then the timer should restart. Oh wow, headshot. Oh, we got this. Oh wow, he fell off. 
Time should restart now. About now. There. Nice! Then we should get another one of those Gatling gun guys. Which are going to be harder to feed, but. Whatever. Best if we have those uh, grenades. Oh god. Oh crap. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna do this. Then. There we go. He's dead. Should get the Gatling gun guy. In a moment. Come on, Gatling gun. There. Oh, I didn't get it. Must be a bit closer. Oh, can we use the rotten egg? Let's see. Okay, we can throw it at him, but nothing really happens. Oh! Oh god. That's now I'm gonna hide. See, it's very difficult. Right. Oh wow, he's dead, yes! Now, we just gotta wait for the Agitator Magini. Which we'll use our uh, rocket launcher for. And he will appear out here, so we're gonna wait. He should be the last thing we kill. And then we should get the achievement for it. Then, in a moment, I think about 25 on the timer, we should get him. Or sometimes later, but hopefully now. Yes, there we go! Now, now we're just going to use this. And these two fat dudes are dead as well. We should get the achievement. There we go, yes. And it's called Shoot the Messenger. Right, so I'm just going to use my Magnum. I forgot to use my Magnum on those. On that Gatling Gun enemy, by the way. I'm just going to... Why not? Nice! Last oh, shot with the Magnum. There we go. And then we just watch this.
would have done better. I'm sorry, Josh. He was... He was a brave soldier. He was... My friend. And if we don't help Sheva and Chris, he will have died for nothing. You're right. Let's go see if we can help them. In which they do. Oh, God. And we should get the achievement for... Oh, we did get an S rank! Oh. Okay. Never mind, then. You can now play as Josh in Desperate Escape. You can now feel drill and Josh in the extra features. Figures, I mean. So we should get two achievements. The Great Escape. Oh, so I, I wasn't expecting an S rank, to be honest, but okay. And then for actually beating Desperate Escape. Get away! On any difficulty settings. Nice. Okay, so I don't need to do this again. Well, apart from getting the professional mode achievement, but I mean, still. But my god, this is ray hard. So yeah, and yes, we've unlocked Josh, and he appears on the other side for some reason. Hmm. But yes, that is a uh, desperate escape, um, which is the second DLC mission. So. That is it for Resident Evil 5 then, I guess. So, I'd like to thank you guys for watching this series of videos. Um, and I think because of the extra figures, I think we should have all of them. Oh no, that's just normal figures. It's extra figures. Yeah, but there's two left. I think for these two, I think you have to uh, complete certain things in the mercenaries, I think. So, that's probably why. So, but I wasn't I wasn't expecting to get an S rank because I died twice. It could be my accuracy. I don't know. But yes. Um. So that'll be it for um. Uh, Resident Evil Five then I guess. I'd like to thank you guys for watching this series of videos. It's been a pleasure. And unfortunately, the points you get in uh both Lost in Nightmares and Desperate Escape do not count as the points you, you can use to purchase things in the bonus features. Those points don't count, because uh, they're separate, so... So they probably have a separate leaderboard or something, I'm not sure, but... But yes, um, that'll be it for Resident Evil 5. Uh, thank you guys for watching the series, the, this was a pleasure. I should say, guys, next time with the next game, don't know what will be after this, but then after another, it will definitely do the long Resident Evil 6. So I shall see you guys then. Shame about. See you guys next time. Bye!